Hey, um, I have a solution to your problem, and it may not have worked the first time, but um, here's an alternate way of doing it. Um, when you have Safari open, and you go to your downloads window like you were before, and open the containing folder, you will have the Mac OS X cursors. This is where you double click on it, you know, extract all files. And first, you have to extract all files and browse to a place that you know. So I saved it to um, my username, program documents, and then LS10 cursors. So I'm going to do is exit out of here. And first of all, I'm going to find where I extracted it to. So I extracted it to computer. Um, here, no. I extracted it to, sorry. You go to my username and my documents. I can find these things here and program documents. So here's the actual folder. I'm going to minimize this and what I'm going to do is go into my computer, go into your local disk, double click on Windows and find cursors. Double click on this cursors files folder and then you're going to go to where you saved this, right click and cut and then come into here and right click and paste the Mac OS 10 cursors folder. Uh, you don't have to extract every single one and put it in individually like this. Just put the folder in here. If I let you double click on the folder, all those files will be there. Um, and that is another way to get them to show up in the control panel mouse menu. So if I open control panel now and I go down to mouse or go to control panel home then go to mouse and go to pointers um, the OS 10 cursor should be there for you. So I hope that helps you. Um, anyone else has questions? Um, go ahead and subscribe and uh, go ahead and um, post a video response or a comment or something like he did and you'll get your answer. So I hope that helps you. Thanks for watching. Peace.